Hey, sports card fans, it's John Wade Boggs fan. Hope you're all doing well. For this month's look at the top 10 PSA vintage baseball card sales on eBay for cards from the 1950s, 60s, and 70s, there are some cards that typically show up on the three top 10 lists. But for the 1950s, there are some cards that don't normally show up on the top 10 list, including one card with a new record high sale. For cards from the 1960s, there's a pretty good variety of cards that show up on this month's top 10 list, including a couple new record high sales. And for cards from the 1970s, it's always interesting to see which cards make the top 10 list. And this month includes a couple record high sales. So let's go check out the three top 10 lists for August 2024. Let's start off with the cards from the 1950s. Coming in at number 10, we have this 1953 Topps Mickey Mantle in a PSA 5. This one sold on August 14th for $10,500. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 5 is $7,885. The record high sale was $12,000 back in February of 2021 through eBay. Now there were two other significant 1953 Topps Mickey Mantle sales in August. One was a PSA 6 copy that sold on August 16th for $10,000 and then a PSA 5 copy sold on August 8th for $7,695. At number 9, we have this 1951 Bowman Whitey Ford rookie card in a PSA 8. This one sold on August 5th for $10,629. It was an auction. There were 38 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $15,054. The record high sale, though, was $33,600 back in February of 2022 through Heritage. At number 8, we have this 1952 Topps Eddie Matthews rookie card in a PSA 5. This one sold on August 5th for $11,088. It was an auction. There were seven bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 5 is $10,272. The record high sale, though, was $14,498 back in May of 2023 through Memory Lane. At number 7... We have this 1954 Dandy Potato Chips Mickey Mantle in a PSA 7. This one sold on August 3rd for $12,000. It was a buy it now. The current VCP average price for a PSA 7 is $11,250. So this $12,000 sale represents a new record high for a PSA 7 copy. The previous high was $10,500 back in July of 2021 through Heritage. At number 6, we have this 1952 Topps Willie Mays in a PSA 5. This one sold on August 29th for $12,099. It was an auction. There were 30 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 5 is $9,732. The record high sale, though, was $34,800 back in April of 2022 through REA. Now, there were two other significant 52 Tops Willie Mays sales in August. One was another PSA 5 copy that sold on August 4th for $8,989. And then another PSA 5 sold on August 18th for $8,500. At number 5, we have this 1957 Topps Mickey Mantle in a PSA 8. This one sold on August 16th for $12,700. It was a buy it now. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $10,978. The record high sale was $21,600 back in February of 2023 
through a heritage auction. Now, there was one other significant 57 Tops Mickey Mantle sale in August, another PSA 8 copy. This one's selling on August 3rd for $10,100. At number four, we have this 1955 Tops Roberto Clemente rookie card in a PSA 7. This one sold on August 18th for $14,300. It was an auction. There were four bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 7 is $14,628. The record high sale, though, was $31,070 back in May of 2016 through Heritage. Now, there was one other significant Roberto Clemente rookie card sale in August. This one, another PSA 7 copy, sold on August 4th for $14,250. At number three, we have this 1951 Bowman Willie Mays rookie card in a PSA 5.5. This one sold on August 19th for $15,208. It was an auction. There were 74 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 5.5 is $16,969. The record high sale, though, was $31,200 back in March of 2021 through a PWCC listing on eBay. Now, there were two other significant 51 Bowman Willie Mays sales in August. One was a PSA 5 that sold on August 6th for $14,477, and then a PSA 4 copy that sold on August 14th for $12,000. At number 2, we have this 1956 Topps Mickey Mantle Grayback version in a PSA 8. This one sold on August 11th for $20,750. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $16,125. The record high sale, though, was $23,700 back in May of 2023 through PWCC. Now, there were two other 56 Tops Mickey Mantle sales in August, both grayback versions. Another PSA 8 sold on August 5th for $19,600, and yet another PSA 8 sold on August 9th for $15,000. And at number one, we have this 1951 Bowman Mickey Mantle rookie card in a PSA 5. This one sold on August 20th for $30,000. It was a buy it now. The current VCP average price for a PSA 5 is $24,455. The record high sale, though, was $55,100 back in March of 2021 through eBay. And there were two other significant 51 Bowman Mickey Mantle sales in August. A PSA 3.5 copy sold on August 6th for $14,900 and then a PSA 2.5 copy sold on August 8th for $13,899. All right, on to the top 10 for cards from the 1960s. At number 10, we have this 1969 Topps Willie Mays in a PSA 9. This one sold on August 22nd for $3,939. It was an auction, there were 31 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 9 is $4,395. The record high sale was $8,700 back in June of 2023 through PWCC. Now, in a PSA 9, there have been 88 graded copies. There have only been 6 graded a PSA 10. At number 9. We have this 1969 Topps Reggie Jackson rookie card in a PSA 8. This one sold on August 20th for $4,000. It was a buy it now. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $3,503. The record high sale, though, was $6,950 back in March of 2021 through eBay. At number 8. 
we have this 1964 Topps Mickey Mantle NA PSA 8. This one sold on August 8th for $4,425. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $3,683. The record high sale was $6,300 back in April of 2023 through eBay. Now there was one other significant 64 Tops Mickey Mantle sale in August. Another PSA 8 copy sold on August 24th for $4,300. At number 7, we have this 1961 Tops Ron Fairley Bottom of Baseball is Green. If you notice on the picture of the back of the card, uh, right under the baseball that has the card number 492, you can see just a little bit of the bottom of that baseball has a little bit of the green from the main background of the card. So this is an error version, and this one sold on August 22nd for $4,500. It was a buy it now. Now, there's no current VCP average price for a PSA 9. The last PSA 8 sold, 8 sold for $444 back in September of 2022. In a PSA 8, there have only been 14 copies graded. In this PSA 9, this is one of only two that have been graded a PSA 9. And uh, this sale was not in VCP's database. There's no recorded or reported sales of any PSA 9 copies in VCP's database. At number six, we have this 1963 Topps Mickey Mantle in a PSA 8. This one sold on August 12th for $4,602. It was an auction. There was only one bid. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $5,457. The record high sale though was $14,700 back in March of 2023 through eBay. At number five, we have this 1961 Topps Billy Williams rookie card in a PSA 9. This one sold on August 14th for $5,900. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 9 is $4,670. The record high sale was $7,800 back in August of 2022 through REA. Now in a PSA 9, there have been 52 graded copies. Only two have been graded a PSA 10. At number four, we have this 1969 Topps Mickey Lolich in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 13th for $6,000. It was a buy it now. Uh, now this auction didn't have a picture of the back of the card, only the front. Uh, the v current VCP average price for a PSA 10 is $4,519. So this sale at $6,000 represents a new record high sale for a PSA 10 copy. The previous high was $3,037 back in May of this year through memory lane. Now, in a PSA 9, there have been 36 graded copies, but this PSA 10 copy here is one of only three that have been graded a PSA 10. At number three, we have this 1964 Topps Pete Rose in a PSA 8.5. This one sold on August 11th for $7,155. It was an auction. There were 36 bids. Uh, the current VCP average price for a PSA 8.5 is this sale at $7,155 and represents a new record high sale for a PSA 8.5 copy. The previous high was $6,300 back in February of 2021 through an eBay auction. Now, in a PSA 8.5, there have been 24 graded copies. 36 have been graded a PSA 9 and none have been graded a PSA 10. At number two, we have this 1963 Topps Pete Rose rookie card in a PSA 7.5. This one sold on August 25th for $7,400. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 7.5 is $8,370. 
The record high sale was $9,900 back in March of 2021 through REA. And at number one, we have this 1968 Topps Nolan Ryan Rookie Card NA PSA 8. This one sold on August 2nd for $8,500. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8 is $8,699. The record high sale, though, was $11,400 back in December of 2021 through REA. Now, there was one other significant Nolan Ryan rookie card sale in August. This one, a PSA 7.5, sold on August 18th for $5,000. $30. All right, on to the cards from the 1970s. Coming in at number 10, we have this 1976 Opeachy Dennis Eckersley rookie card in a PSA 9. This one sold on August 8th for $2,750. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price is $2,750. The record high sale was $4,000 back in February of 2022 through eBay. Now, this PSA 9 copy is one of only 17 that have been graded a PSA 9. There have only been three graded a PSA 10. At number 9, we have this 1972 Opeachy Roberto Clemente in a PSA 9. This one sold on August 29th for $2,850. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 9 is $2,006. So this sale at $2,850 represents a new record high sale for a PSA 9 copy. The previous high was $1,750 back in March of this year through eBay. Now in a PSA 9, there have been 21 graded copies. None have been graded a PSA 10. At number 8, we have this 1970 Topps Thurman Munson Rookie Card in a PSA 9. This one sold on August 6th for $3,000. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 9 is $2,656. The record high sale was $4,463 back in December of 2022 through eBay. Now, in this PSA 9, there have been 88 graded copies. Only four have been graded a PSA 10. At number 7, we have this 1978 Topps Mickey Rivers in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 11th for $3,000. It was an auction. There were 37 bids. The current VCP average price is this sale at $3,000 and represents a new record high for a PSA 10 copy. The previous high was $1,825 back in October of 2021 through eBay. Now, there have been 71 copies graded a PSA 9. This PSA 10 here is one of only seven that have received a PSA 10 grade. At number six. We have this 1973 Topps Nolan Ryan in a PSA 9. This auction did not have a picture of the back of the card. Uh, it sold on August 20th for $3,278. It was an auction. There were nine bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 9 is $3,158. The record high sale was $4,700 back in August of 2022 through eBay. Now, in a PSA 9, there have been 145 graded copies. Only six have been graded a PSA 10. At number five, we have this 1972 Topps Collier Stremski in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 25th for $3,283. It was an auction. There were 73 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 10 is $3,779. The record high sale was $6,666 back in May of 2022 through Memory Lane. Now there have been 232 copies graded a PSA 9. Only 12 have been graded a PSA 10. 
At number four, we have this 1975 Topps Joe Morgan in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 25th for $3,358. It was an auction. There were 61 bids. The current VCP average price for a PSA 10 is $4,860. But the record high sale was $27,258 back in May of this year through Memory Lane. There have been 339 copies graded a PSA 9. Only 9 have been graded a PSA 10. At number 3... We have this 1971 Kellogg's Tom Seaver in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 24th for $3,500. It was a best offer. The current VCP average price for a PSA 10 is only $710. So this sale at $3,500 would represent a new record high sale for a PSA 10 copy. The previous high sale was only $799 back in September of 2015 through PWCC listing on eBay. There have been 11 graded a PSA 9, only 6 have been graded a PSA 10. At number 2, we have this 1975 Topps Fred Lynn Rookie Card in a PSA 10. This one sold on August 30th for $3,986. It was an auction, there was only one bid. The current VCP average price for a PSA 10 is $3,673. The record high sale, though, was $12,000 back in February of 2022 through PWCC. There have been 196 copies graded a PSA 9, but this card here is one of only 20 that have been graded a PSA 10. And at number 1... We have this 1971 Topps Willie Mays in a PSA 8.5. This one sold on August 2nd for $5,000. It was a buy it now. The current VCP average price for a PSA 8.5 is $4,240. So this $5,000 sale represents a new record high for a PSA 8.5 copy. The previous high was $3,480 back in May of this year through Heritage. Now, there have been seven graded a PSA 8.5, only 12 graded a PSA 9, and none have been graded a PSA 10. Well, there you go. The top 10 PSA vintage baseball card sales on eBay for cards from the 1950s, 60s, and 70s for August 2024. As always, we'd love to know what you think about the cards that made the three top 10 lists. And with that, that's all I have for you. So until next time, thanks for watching.